Anyways, with that debate outside of the... The, realm, even the realm of relevance. Yeah, the realm of relevance, I suppose, <laughs> in this scenario. Oh, dope music Go! choice. Yeah. Alright. Oh, wow. That, that, <laughs> this really does feel like a 2D game. <laughs> yeah. You know, actually, I don't think I've ever seen this matchup before. It's kind of funny. I kind of enjoy it. Yeah, it's pretty way. sick. All right, but right now, uh, you know, Mamba took kind of the brunt of the damage, but that does give Terry go, which could be a good position, but going to punish the landing because the overextension with the up B, able to just fully vulnerable state, eat the forward smash and uh, die off the side. Uh, Nameless with a good start here. Hello, Ken. All right, I like the I like the distance. It's being maintained by Nameless here. Keeping like my mouth. Shooting out the Hadoukens. All right, Mamba able to, able to seal the stuff. Yeah, finally able to even it out, but could it be too little too late? I mean, you can't really ever say that about Terry with Go. So, it's a little bit, uh, yeah. Okay. What? This is the Trishikin. This work gets very dangerous. Ooh. Oh. And yeah, like that, even though Mamba had a severe percent deficit, he was able to take the kill first. Uh, so when Nameless uh, returned in kind, it's now just neck and neck, even even. Yeah, don't underestimate Go. Whoa. Oh. Well, this stage be mad pretty, yo. Whoa. It is a pretty stage. Ooh. It's just, you know, it's strange. There, there is sort of this kind of hatred towards Shogun's, but I feel like when you have a character like Terry versus the Shogun, it, it displays this sort of beautiful, like, 2D gameplay. And then you have this epic background. It's just, <laughs> it just, it's just badass. Yeah, it, te it technically doesn't feel, it, 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 te it, it oddly fits as well. So it's just like, anyway, Mamba taking game one. Okay. That was pretty back and forth uh, between the two of them, honestly. You know, let's see this last stock again. Uh, took it out with the... Uh, I don't know what the move is called. That What is that called? Uh, bus no, not Buster Wolf. It's, is it Buster? No, no that's, the, that's the Go version. That's the Go version. <laughs> anyway, Burn Knuckle, thank you. Yeah, so Fair enough. let's do this uh, the first stock again, where try to kind of kill him off the top, but left herself super vulnerable, and uh, ate a forward smash. And then Mamba returns the favor with a nice, nice, uh, I forget what all the moves are called. Anyway. <laughs> Nice go attack, and then the other go attack. That's that's the Buster Wolf, yeah. <laughs> um, I think there's gonna be a Power Geyser here, I think. No, never mind. Yeah, Power Geyser was the previous one. Tamaki, and then Shrieken, uh. and then.
And now we're going to see another Shoto. Yeah. We're going to see the Ken. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. So I didn't quite comment too much on the previous game. Not because there wasn't much to analyze, but because it really did feel like a CD fighter. From a more stacked point of view, it's, I think, for the most part, Nameless is just keeping out with three ten, and then whenever Black Combo leaves herself open, because obviously some of Terry's moves are a little bit laggy. So some of those are a little bit of a hard commitment. Mm -hmm. um, and so I feel like that's kind of the way you've got to analyze Shoto's and perhaps even a fake Shoto. You kind of just have to examine their gameplay in that fashion. Um, but when you imagine it in a 2D game, <gasps> if you imagine this as a Shoto battle... Oh, that was, that was almost a kill. Yeah. But if you imagine this as a 2D game, this really just feels like classic 2D fighter gameplay. Um, whoever pushes forward first gets the gets the hit. Yeah. So uh, whoever misses the hit gets punched. Yeah. Nameless gonna be taking the first stock. Uh, now only entering triple digits. Let's see uh, what kind of residual extra credit uh, he's able to land before he loses the stock. Mm -hmm. Already doing some really serious damage. Uh oh. Yeah, I like I like the dash packs here. Just waiting for uh, those burn knuckles to come out and punish the lag. Very nice, very nice. Okay, Paradong not gonna be enough. Oh wow, jumps right into the uh, power geyser because it was super like. It lasts really long. Uh, so he ended up putting himself in a position. Oh my god. Shuriken. Man, that was great shield pressure on the top flat. That was great. Uh. Oh man, those rising tickles. Ugh. So it seems like whenever Nameless is trying to recover, Black Mamba kind of has the upper hand. But whenever Black Mamba is trying to land a game, Nameless is able to just punish them. And so it really comes down to who can sport first. But also, who does the best in their place? And oh, they had a full letter. So, Nameless going to be taking game two with a two stock. I did it. You sure did, Ken. You sure did. You really you did what Ryu couldn't. He really says, I did it. Good lord. Yeah, I don't think I quite commented on that a lot. There were a lot of good focus times. Yeah. Here. Yeah. It, it's a it's a different style of uh, of counter. You know, it's really interesting. You just like tank their hit. Oh, and they see like all these up -ease. That was so funny. It was just like, please. All three stocks were taken with Shuriken. Even though that one whiffed, it went right into another one. Boom. Yeah, this this match is gonna be interesting. Let's see what stage pick it is. PS2. Alrighty. Uh oh. <sighs> okay. All right. Mamba taking a, mm, nah, just super even percentages right now. Mamba, it, it seems is kind of driving uh, the the control right now, but then as I say it, like Nameless kind of turns it around. Could that be death? It is. Oh, wow. Lands all the hits of it because uh, Ken's version is multi-hit. All right. Just 
just nice conversions over the whole game. It's... Oh boy. Nameless, uh, no. Stop challenging. Just, just land. This is a really bad position, especially the fact that every time when Terry loses a stock, loses go, and it's just a really bad position because he wants that comeback factor. All right. Oh, this is the uh, it gets intense. Oh my God! Oh no! Shurikens all around. That was such too a much. Good. Challenge me after some practice. Okay, Ken. Oh, what is? Challenge me after <laughs> some practice. What a dickhead. <laughs> Did he have to dash for that? Uh, uh, let's see. To show you. Yeah. Yeah, dash. Yeah, again, all three stocks were taken with uh, Shoryuken. Boom. That one was pretty nuts, though, because it, it, like, it took a long time for all of those hits to connect, but they eventually did. Stop challenging! No. Yeah. Well, either way, we'll see how Mamba is able to do in the uh, the losers bracket run. Wish you good luck. Ooh. Yeah. Wish you good luck, Black Mamba.